Hi and welcome to this video on story building in Tableau. Dashboards are made of worksheets. While a story contains a sequence of worksheets or dashboards or both that work together to convey certain information. A Tableau story is a sequence of visualizations that work together to convey information. Stories are a powerful way to tell a data narrative, provide context, demonstrate how decisions relate to outcome, or simply make a compelling case. Let's begin with loading our data onto Tableau. From the Connections pane, click on the Text File option, and we are navigated to where our data called Accidents is located. Select the data and hit OK. As our data is loaded in Tableau, we can also see a preview of the fields present inside our dataset. Let's go to our worksheet now. Drag the date field onto the columns shelf and measure Accident Severity onto the rows shelf. Drag another measure light conditions onto the rows shelf as well. From the Show Me tab, select a visualization type. We select Dual Combination and we have this neat visual on our screen. Next, double click on the title above and customize it. Now, let's move to sheet number two. Drag sum of age of casualties onto the rows. And from the Show Me tab, select Histogram. This gives us a histogram view of casualty count by age. Let's double click on the title and type in our required text for this view. Moving on to our third worksheet, drag and drop major names onto the view. This gives us the major names and its corresponding values as a table. We would edit the major names from the filter shelf and keep only the relevant data. Let's just drag and adjust the sizing. Click on the elements in our view and select Format. This brings up a format window where we can color, size, and align our text on the visualization. Now, at the very end, double click on the title of the sheet and name it according to your visualization. It's time to build a dashboard now. Once opened, the first thing we suggest is to adjust the size of your visualization. Then, since we want a neat and professional looking dashboard, so let's just drag the vertical arrangement on the visualization. Drag one sheet at a time and arrange on your dashboard area. Also drag and drop a text onto your dashboard from the objects pane. Let's drag it to the very top. We can manually adjust the sizes here and bring our dashboard into a presentable view. Now, click on this icon below and open a storyboard. At the very start, once again, set the storyboard size. Let's choose automatic. You can then add various sheets and dashboards to create a story point, which you can find on the pane at the side here. Tableau contains story points where each story point is either a worksheet or a dashboard. So you can drag the sheets into your story point. Now, let's add a sheet containing the dashboard to the story first. All the sheets and dashboards that are added to a story are connected to the original forms. So any changes made to the original sheets or dashboards are reflected in the story. By default, your story gets its title from the sheet name. Like we got story 1 at the top. We can write our own title here. 
by double clicking on the title text. Let's input mobility hazards, data collection campaign as the storyboard title. We can also add a caption to summarize the story point by clicking on add a caption and then writing it. Let's add the caption. Let's get started. I will drag the caption area and adjust the size. It is possible to add another story point by simply dragging and bringing another sheet to drop on the storyboard. As we drag and hover it, you can see that two small arrows appear next to the caption area. This is where a sequence of our various sheets will be created and we can drop it either to the right or to the left of the previous caption. So let's drop it here. Relation between light conditions and its impact on accident severity is the new caption. Let's continue adding story points and adding captions. At the end, let's drag a blank story point and put it onto our storyboard. Type its caption. Now drag a text and drop onto the storyboard. And yes, we have just created a story point of our own at the end. We can also enter the presentation mode from this icon at the top here or by pressing F7. You can see that the story is also interactive and we can swiftly move across our story points and present in detail. Thanks a lot for watching this video and we hope you learn how to easily get started with your own set of data in Tableau.